are having a fun day because the Harlem Globetrotters are here, who are amazing. And we've had some really good round one cupcakes. I think you've inspired everyone. I hope so. Um, that's what we do. That's right. All those quintessential New York flavors on the table. Which one was your favorite, Florian? Probably the pastrami sandwich. Pastrami sandwich. From New York City. It was the most surprising. It was really interesting. It was really cool. In presentation uh -huh. and in concept. Mm -hmm. oh. She baked a real cupcake. Yeah. She sliced it in half. Mm -hmm. She made a sandwich out of it. I that love, was unusual. I love that she incorporated the rye like you would find the pastrami sandwich on that, you know, classic rye bread. She incorporated mm. it into a vanilla cupcake. It still had the sweetness of a cupcake. It still had the character of a cupcake, but it was absolutely undeniably a pastrami sandwich. That's what we're looking for. We, we want to be surprised. We want to be surprised. It, and surprised, but he has to work. Yeah. I was telling flight time and obviously he knows he's been, he's been in Harlem Globetrotters for 14 years, he said. I grew up with the Harlem Globetrotters. I mean, we had them on TV, you know, periodically. And, you know, this is something that uh, we know. It's, it's part of our culture almost. I mean, seriously, in France, they are very famous, very, very famous. And we still go back twice a year to France. So Twice a year, yeah, wow. twice a year. They still love us, so we continue to come back. That's it. When I was 12, I went to a Harlem Globetrotters game in St. Louis, Missouri. And I went down to the court. I shot a basket and I sunk it. And they were like, you kid, you could be a professional basketball player. And today I learned that they say that to every kid. I don't see how you even eat as much of those as you do. Like you need quite a bit of them. I know. The flight time, do you ever do you ever have an off day when you're when you're doing your thing or you're doing your Globe Trotter show? Do you have an off day ever? Like you got the thing spinning and it just won't go, or you just have been doing it for so long now that it's like clockwork? Well, I mean, of course, I mean, we do have, we have our bad days, but we have way more good days and bad days. And when we're having bad days, we just try to cover it up with a lot of energy and just keep smiling. Keep your game bad face vibe. on. Game face all the time. Matthew, yeah. a lesson straight from the Harlem Globetrotters. Mm -hmm. Free thinking. 